Aaron, you look at the way you guys were able to win this game. Is it just par for the course for this team who has had so many ups and downs throughout the course of the season? I think so. Uh, I mean, a, a very fitting way, I think, to end it, to get in on the last day, last inning, last pitch. Judgey, who's, who's had such a great regular season for us, um, fitting that he would drive it in. And, um, you know, we've been through a lot this year, and it's been a tough year. Um, but it's a confident group, and we're in the dance now and, and looking forward to the, to the opportunity to go chase something really special. Was there any part of you that thought they might walk Aaron Judge in that situation? No, not no, I didn't, because I didn't think they'd want to bring the walk into play. Um, you know, I thought they'd pitch him tough, obviously, but um, knowing how the Rays do things there, I, I didn't think they would do it just... You're playing a batting average versus on base game at that point. Uh, obviously, you would have been able to push him back, and um, I'm sure it was a little bit tempting, but I thought they would pitch to him. Anthony Rizzo absolutely smoked the ball to the outfield. Did you think there was a chance that Tyler Wade could score on that play? Oh, I always think Tyler Wade can score. I mean, a great job by him of tagging up, first of all, on the fly ball to the outfield to get to second. Um, but my eyes went immediately to the outfield, and I saw it. Obviously, it was smoked right to him and charging the ball. So I was like, oh, no, and I know he throws well. So then my eyes went over to third to Wader and Phil, and um, I thought it was the right thing to hold them up as the throw ended up over the line, up the line a little bit, so you never know. But I think if it's an on-target throw, I think he's probably dead to rights. There's enough offense to get the job done, but really the pitching staff did a tremendous job this afternoon. How much of that did you have mapped out? How much of it was by feel going to different guys? Um... <clears throat> I guess a little bit of both. Um, it, look, it started with J-Mo. J-Mo, you know, frankly, going in, I was hoping for one inning, maybe two innings. If everything went great, three. The fact that he was able to go get us, I think, 13 outs um, or 13 batters, uh, got 10 outs for us into the fourth, really set us up well. Because, obviously, we knew we had all our guys, and, and we could use them all the way we did kind of protecting one another because you know as much as obviously we needed to win this game and wanted to win this game if we lost there's a game tomorrow so we wanted to be in a position where we had our guys and the fact that they all came in and did such a good job and were so pitch efficient uh i mean they were they were awesome is there a sigh of relief no 163 have the data rest yeah no no question um i think you know i just answered in, the, in in my press conference in there you know a little bit of exhale uh a lot of joy because you know what this year's been and how tough it's been and uh what we've been through and and all the people that have have a hand into you know getting to do what we want to do and that's go play meaningful games now this month um so there's there's some joy in that, but also, you know, real shortly here we it's back it's back to work and we got bigger fish to fry now. You mentioned the joy. It seemed like some guys were experiencing some joy in that clubhouse, having a little bit of fun. But I know you like to address them first. What did you say to your team after this win? You know what? I I stood back and and you know, Guardy had the belt and we had the ball and um, I just let them have their moment and, and enjoy it. I was kind of on the outskirts and. Um, it was kind of like a belt ceremony um, with a little champagne mixed in. It looks like it's going to be Boston. What do you like about that matchup? Well, I mean, look, they're a great team. Um, we've obviously had many battles with them over the years. Um, I'm sure it's going to be a battle Tuesday night. Uh, we look forward to the challenge. Um, and hopefully we can go out and, and, and play really good baseball and move on. But um, you, know, you know it's going to be a challenge playing the Sox.